yeah everybody is excited about uh, you know whatsapp as a channel and uh, the first thought uh, when we talk to an organization is uh, to implement like a conversational bot or a commerce bot which i think is great because uh, you could reduce the cost uh, you know by uh, a factor of 10 or 20 or you know there's no limit depending on the use case however i think that's a very simplistic approach uh, and you know a you you could you could definitely have a bot which will handle uh, some of the repeated queries and you know which will which will improve over time but that's not the end of the conversation and that's true for all use cases that we have seen across so you may have a bot you may not have a bot it could be a simple data collection bot it could be a question answer bot but there has to be a human being at the other end when somebody is writing a message to you on whatsapp and a blue tick is coming you're expecting a response from a human being and, and, and it's a very psychological thing right think about it so there has to be an option for uh, the consumer to get connected to uh, an expert an agent and and therein lies the challenge that how could uh, for example let's say a bank which is solving hundreds of uh, use cases and inquiries how do now they distribute these chats across uh, uh across various experts and agents and teams and uh, thereby uh you know having the best person respond to the query after the bot right so uh, people are thinking bot only uh my thought is think human first and then see which part of it can you automate instead of uh, thinking bot first uh, bot uh, is here to stay they would reduce the amount of interactions going to the humans but humans will gain more importance in responding to complex queries in responding to uh, you know uh, areas where emotion is involved the other problem that we see uh, is that thinking whatsapp as the only channel and that it is operating as a standalone mechanism so uh, that is never true right your customer has uh, approached you there is a profile so we have to make sure that the agent is capable of understanding the context of the customer so let's say if somebody had ordered now there is a, a whatsapp conversation uh, you know there was an email or there was a phone call that happened prior to that all that has to be visible to the agent as a, a 360 degree view of the consumer uh, so you know we should not look at whatsapp as a channel in isolation you could also have stuff where for example uh, you are talking to the agent and you know this now requires a video call to happen Uh, you know we are solving the video kyc so for example let's say kyc initiated would you like a video call right now and the same agent uh, is able to initiate a video call so the the time span across channels these cannot be disjoint right this has to be like stitched into a journey and uh, this could very easily you know so let's say a bot bot to a whatsapp chat a whatsapp chat to a conversation over phone or uh, video all this should be extremely seamless and agent should be capable of taking those decisions only then you would get like the real advantage of uh, the speed of whatsapp and uh, the 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 trust of the customer that uh, you know there is a human being on the other side he's very approachable and that's how he will start visualizing the business so yeah so two things uh, don't think what first uh, you know think human first and then add bots and then second don't think uh, whatsapp as a channel in isolation